So here we've got the figure in the packaging. We have Miss Marvel figure with an extra set of hands and the Infinity Ultron build a figure piece, the torso. Then on the side we have some artwork of Miss Marvel or Kamala Khan. And then here on the back we've got some more artwork of Miss Marvel, description of her and all the other figures in this wave. And then on this side we have some more artwork here of Miss Marvel just has the Miss Marvel logo there on the top. This unfortunately is probably the last wave we're gonna get that has the actual window in it. And I just wanna show you the back real quick, a closer shot of all the other figures in this wave. Shows there, um, I'm most excited for Moon Knight. Um, I haven't got any other figures from this wave yet. I just got this one in today and I have no idea when the other ones are gonna ship because they all say different times. I really don't know. Hopefully, I'd imagine since this one just shipped and I got it, that the rest will be here within a week or so, but I mean, you never know. Let's get this thing open. This is Miss Marvel out of the packaging. She comes with a set of gripping hands and a set of fisted hands, as well as the Infinity Ultron torso, which I will show you details on that in a bit but first let's get into this figure the head sculpt on this figure looks good i love the little detail here on the mask the little gold lines always love the fine details most of the head sculpts on the new marvel legends figures all look pretty good because of the face scan technology i love the details here on the miss marvel logo on her suit you can see the turquoise and red lines throughout her logo on her chest which is really cool because they're so tiny it really adds to this figure and then you can see over here on her arm her bangle and you can see the inscriptions and stuff on it a little bit which is awesome another fine detail which is cool um, let's check out her arms a little bit i love the texturing here on her arms looks good you see the blue going underneath here it looks pretty good on this side too texturing you can see on the side here, you can see sort of the gold lines and everything here on the side too, which looks really good. And then if we look a little bit lower here, down here, those little white marks, I think those are actually inscriptions. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's what those are. Those are really cool. Either way, it's really cool um, effect there. Looks really good on her outfit. Mine got a little bit of a gold splash of paint down here. It's not a super big deal, but it's still something that sort of bums me out a little bit but it's not bad and then you can see a little bit of texturing on her pants down here mainly on sides here looks pretty good a little bit of the wrinkles and everything and i love the shoes the shoes look awesome um most of the time they don't actually paint the laces like this i mean sometimes they do but i love when they do because it just adds to the detail looks really really cool so now we're going to take a look at the back of the figure the hair looks pretty good it's not too bad. I wish they would have done a little more shading on it, but overall it's not bad. It's pretty good still. Then we've got a little bit on the back. You can see the detailing here, and that's the purple part there. I love the gold lines as well. And then you got her iconic scarf there. And then more of those sort of details here on the back looks good. And you can see more of that detail on her legs. So now I'm going to show you the Infinity Ultron torso that comes with Miss Marvel. Right here on the chest, we've got the infinity stones i love the gold lines on this looks really cool and then i love this metallic finish or this sort of like gunmetal gray color looks shiny like ultron wood looks good we got some more gold down here gold on his waist there let's see if we have anything on the back here there's a peg for the cape not much else really on the back just see that gold there i love the inside of the cape here Looks really cool with these darker maroon or darker red colors here. Looks cool for like the shadows and the style of the What If series. And then we've got this gold stripe here. Looks good. And then on the back of the cape, that same gold stripe sort of continues through this side. We've got these like horns or hooks here. Not exactly sure what they call them. Looks cool. And I like how they come up through this cape here. Looks really cool. These shoulder pads look good too. I can't wait to get the rest of the figures so I can actually put this thing together and I'll be doing a review on this Infinity Ultron figure once I get all the pieces. 
Okay, so now we're going to move on to the articulation portion of the video. So her head can look down about that far. Up, not very much. Her hair restricts her head movement quite a bit. Rotation, uh, not very much. Her arms go up about that far. And then elbows in, wrist down about that far. Up, almost all the way. And her bangle actually does rotate right here, which is cool. And then for the ab crunch, uh, she really can't bend forward. A little bit backwards, mm, side to side, not much. And she does not have a waist cut that I'm aware of. I mean, she, she might underneath there, but I can't really tell <laughs> about toward the whole stage down. She does have thigh cuts. Uh, Legs go forward that far, backwards that far, double jointed knees, which are pinless, ankles go down that far, up that far, they do rotate side to side. Overall this figure is pretty good. My main critique is I wish we would have gotten more accessories, something like a big cosmic hand or maybe cosmic hands and legs to make the embiggen version of her it would have been really cool maybe we'll get that for the marvels i'm always glad to have new characters for my collection and miss marvel's pretty cool so now i'm going to add her into my collection miss marvel will be going right here next to her hero captain marvel so that is where she is going to be displayed at in my collection so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please don't forget to subscribe and check out some of my other reviews. Have a great day.